Investing in real estate versus starting a business. Low risk options explored. When it comes down to the benefits of investing in real estate compared to starting a business, it's like comparing apples to bicycles. They're both methods of putting your money to work, but they inhabit fundamentally different realms with unique risks and rewards. Let's break them down. Real estate. Stability meets tangibility. Investing in real estate is often hailed as one of the more stable investments you can make, especially over the long term, and Portland's market has been testament to that. With property, you get something tangible. You can touch it, improve it, or rent it out to create cash flow. You're not just buying land or a building. You're buying a piece of a neighborhood, a slice of a city like Portland, ever evolving, ever expanding. Here are some of its key benefits. Cash flow. Rental income can provide steady monthly cash flow that in many cases can increase with inflation. Tax advantages. The IRS offers various deductions for real estate investors, from mortgage interest to depreciation. Appreciation. While not always guaranteed historically, real estate tends to increase in value over time. Leverage. Real estate allows investors to use leverage to buy properties, which can amplify returns, but also increase risks. Diversification. Adding a physical asset like real estate can diversify an investment portfolio, which can buffer against volatility. Starting a business. Higher risks with potentially higher rewards. On the flip side, starting a business is a wholly different beast. Its allure draws many to the entrepreneurial spirit that buzzes through Portland's coffee shops and co-working spaces. You could be building something from scratch, be your own boss, and truly tap into unlimited earning potential if your idea takes off. Benefits include Control. You make the decisions and steer the ship, giving you direct control over your success or failure. Scalability. A successful business can grow exponentially and may become more profitable than most real estate investments. Passion. Many entrepreneurs are driven by a love for what they do, which can make the work more fulfilling than real estate management. Economic contribution. Your business could contribute to the economy by providing jobs and services or products. But let's be real. Starting a business is loaded with risk. A high percentage of new businesses fail within the first few years. It requires significant time, energy, and often a substantial upfront investment with no guarantee of return. Which is the better low-risk investment? It depends on your appetite for risk, your skills, your passions, and your available capital. Real estate is typically seen as the more conservative, lower-risk option. It's slower, steadier, and isn't going to keep you up at night with a cold sweat about quarterly earnings reports. Property investments can serve as a reliable backbone of an investment strategy. Starting a business, while potentially much more rewarding, is riskier. Many factors out of your control can affect your success, especially in the early stages. Consider your goals. Are you looking for stable, long-term investment with passive income potential? Real estate might be your lane. Do you crave a chance to make a significant impact and potentially rake in substantial profits? And you're willing to embrace the risks? then starting a business could be the way to go. Remember, there's no one-size-fits-all answer here. And like with any investment, due diligence is the name of the game. Navigating Portland's market, whether it's snapping up a bungalow in Laurelhurst or launching a startup in the Pearl District, requires patience, research, and sometimes a bit of luck.